It's another Hockey East weekend from Alphond Arena in Orono, Maine. The Maine Black Bears take on the Merrimack Warriors. Teams Merrimack uh, only scores 1.40 goals per game. That is currently second worst in all of NCAA Division I hockey. Maine, four goals a game. That is sixth best. And Josh Nadeau has his first of the season. A minute 10 into the game. And Maine has an early lead. Piled in at the top of the show. That was Brandon Hope, and he gets it to Josh Nadeau. He sells short side shot, puts it on his backhand, gets uh, Lundgren to bite on it, and he's got a lot of open net to just stuff this in the far side. A little bit of traffic. His scoring streak to six games. That's Arnott shot blocked, and the second one by Renwick got blocked as well. Slapping it in. The captain and a transfer from Ferris State. Stopped by Boya on the first attempt by Merrimack. He stops the second as well. An assist at Northeastern in the 4-1 win a week ago today. Jurisevich off a leg. Brazil picks it up. Turning to goal. Josh Nadeau tipped a couple times. Shot percentage, isn't it? Certainly is. As the puck taken off the stick of Van Uhas. Ross Mitten brings in right side. Fires the shot. Lundgren able to hang up for Maine to Owen Fowler. It's a two on two. Brazil joining the rush. Fowler gets around his man. Look to set up Brazil. Don. Antonacci to Renwick. Gets it in. Renwick, good play there. Friel oh. looking to set up Nadeau. Max injuries because they are missing some very key players, including a couple that are out for the entire year. Here's Thomas Friel for the shot, and he scores! Thomas Friel with Scott flying through the slot. Maine makes it 2 0. Gold, he might have gotten a piece of this. He gets to the net front. Nice job by. No, I guess it went by him before Scott got there. We'll see from above and see if uh, Scott gets a piece of it. But good job by. Yeah, he sure did. That's Thomas Friel's goal all the way. Nice adjustment. And the period expires. So Maine gets an early one from Josh Nadeau and then another one late in the period and they'll take a two goal lead to the dressing room. Yeah. Green into the offensive zone, back low to high. Chabriato Holt, Rister made it through. Russell tried to jam. It's Scott with the puck now. Juhas took it away, taken back there. Penalty coming on Merrimack. Russell to Scott, McCarr to Holt. Holt, the one-timer, saved there by Lund. Gave that to Josh Nadeau, now Ross Mitten. Jurisevich, the one-timer, saved Lundgren, the rebound, hopped just wide of the post as Renwick was right there. Shot there by Fowler, stopped by Lundgren, thought he had it, he didn't. Fowler, left point, Josh Nadeau, top of the slot, one-timer, Mitten, that one got blocked by Watville. Has to cut it back. Josh Nadeau, down low, save made by Lundgren on Fowler. Josh Nadeau again as the penalty to ends expires. Another try though. This is Maine's fourth line against Merrimack's second line. And it gets back to what I was saying about getting effective shifts out of every line. You gotta be able to trust your fourth line. You're really just looking for them to keep up the energy and uh, you know not make mistakes. And their fourth line does a little bit more than that. So. Fun to watch. I like Kamarov. I like his game. He's got some jam to it, toughness, and a little bit of finesse. Russell back to Holt. Rister scores! It's tipped in front, and it looks like that might be the first of the year for the captain, Lyndon Breen. Maine's up 3-0. Well, you get a look at it here. Once again, it's Holt, the guy that we talked about at the beginning of the show. He's so good at getting pucks through. A lot of traffic in front. And does Lyndon Breen get a piece of this? He sure thinks he does. Yeah. That's most of the year. Saved by Boya there as he looked like he had to stop the follow-up as well. Back comes Lyndon Breen. Good twist pass there to Antonacci. His shot a little bit weak. Holtz to the top of the slot. A lot of rotation for Maine on this power play. Harrison Scott. Scott. Russell, save, rebound, score! Thomas Friel on the rebound! Main four, Merrimack nothing. Well, Merrimack does not pressure the points. They allow Main to kind of work it around. That time, Russell gets the initial shot as Harrison Scott makes the nice feed to Russell. He takes the play roulette there around to Friel behind the goal. Friel knocked down, the centering feed intercepted that time. Peter in the lineup. 
for every game for the Black Bears this season. And it's turned over to Scholey. Tried to pull forehand and lost the handle. Calafuri gave it away to Cranston. Roy Cranston now Dano back to Cranston. Got it to Roy, but he couldn't get it on net. Ends, turns it ahead, but gave it away. Grayson Arnott with the puck. He'll backhand deep. Nadeau first to it, chips in front. Good save by Lundgren, and the rebound clutches to Mitten. He wasn't in a shooting spot. Now Jurasevich off of Nadeau and wide. Back out front, Nadeau stopped by Lundgren. Another try, Mitten, and that will do it for the second period. 28 seconds of power play time do carry over into the third, and the Black Bears have added two more goals to their lead. Are the power play unit. Scott got it on the backhand over to McCarr. McCarr looking to set up Russell. He scores! Textbook breakout on the power play by Maine, and they're up by five. Once they clear the offensive zone, they attack the blue line with speed, and there's McCarr getting the puck across the slot. Right on the doorstep is Charlie Russell. Good stick position. All he's got to do is get his stick on it, which he does as he goes. And we've got a goaltending switch. Max Lundgren out, 22 seconds into the period. And here's our first look at the transfer from AIC for the season, Nils Wallstrom. Graybell, around it goes. Chabrier keeps it in, centers for Renwick, and it's just wide. Quick release. Period, main up 5 nothing. turned over. It's Dano, save Boya, and the rebound swatted back out to center by Holt. Scholey coming in left wing. Scholey shoots it, saved by Wallstrom. Own end, and Powell coughs it up. Calafiri to Chabrier, doesn't make it through Chabrier again, and Friel looking for Scott. Patrick, and Dano to Cranston, and a save made by Boya. Fitzpatrick. Loses it to Nadeau, it's a two on one. Josh Nadeau looking for McCarr, the one-timer missed up high. So As Maine will improve to 5-0-1 oh, overall and 2-0-1 oh, in Hockey East. You can mark it zero for Albin Boya, his second shutout of the season. Three-point nights for Harrison Scott, for Brandon Holtz, for Thomas Friel, and Charlie Russell, and Maine wins by five. Pretty impressive win for Maine. It's really wire to wire. I mean, they were just in control the whole way.